Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel and today I want to talk to you about a product which I have been using for the past number of weeks which has really got me thinking about a lot of things in regards to scalp health and the importance of scalp health. The product we're going to be looking at today is by the Body Shop range. Now, this is the Body Shop Ginger Shampoo and Conditioner, which we will be going to have a look at. And also we will be touching on the Ginger Scalp Serum Drops, of course, by the Body Shop as well. Three great products which I have been trying now for the past number of weeks. Now, why would you necessarily use a scalp product? Well, simply, why wouldn't you? Very often in life in general, when we're styling our hair and we're always looking at different ways of how we can get our hair and manipulating our hair with heat and different products into different styles, both men and women, of course, me, myself, known for very big volumized hair and always lots of different styles, one of my favorites, 1910s, 1920s, slick back styles but of course that takes a lot of product a lot of uh, I say the problem being that there's a lot in those products which we use now of course sometimes those can be quite harsh and after a number of weeks of using that you may even find that your scalp is a little bit out of balance so for example the styles I use very very often something which can really pinpoint and irritate me is just around the areas of my hair which you'll see is longer on top. At the nape of my neck can sometimes be quite agitated and sometimes my scalp can get a little bit irritated and a little bit sort of out of balance. So very often when I look at products I do try to every now and again break the mold of the products I'm using and I try to use something a bit more softer, a bit more gentle and natural. So then I come to a body shop product which I really really enjoy. Now very often I enjoy using the the green tea range by the body shop which is the Fiji green tea shampoo and conditioner which I have done a review for that as well now I really really enjoy that and how that makes my scalp feel so when I came across the ginger range for the shampoo and the conditioner I really had to try the product especially when it said in regards to scalp care and for weak hair as well. Now the shampoo also is uh, highlighted for using it as a dandruff shampoo product. Now I don't have dandruff, I haven't actually never experienced that at all, but I have experienced an out of balance scalp. And if you want to know the difference is quite clearly, to be quite honest with you as well, if you've got an out of balance scalp, when you've got your styled hair and you go out anywhere, if you feel that your scalp feels tight or if you feel that it feels itchy or uncomfortable, then very often what you will probably find is that your scalp is out of balance and you could do with something to really tone everything down, to really soothe everything and just give your scalp that natural sort of balance and in order for it to breathe quite honestly for you. Now ginger always happens to be a very favourite product of mine, whether it's in a food, whether it's in a beverage, whether it be in a spice if I'm cooking. Now I have to admit, anything with ginger would probably always swing that for me in regards to using a product of that. The smell I find is really, really amazing and I find it very therapeutic if you're not feeling particularly well. Now ginger is said to have a lot of benefits to the body as well. It's actually an inflammatory, naturally. It doesn't say that on these products here at all, but ginger is actually said to improve improve scalp health. So that's probably why the body shop have put that into a shampoo and a conditioner product as well as a scalp serum. Of course we're talking about a scalp care here as well but it does give the cuticle of the hair and the hair benefits as well which we're going to be talking about today. So let's have a look first of all at the product of the shampoo. So for example the ginger shampoo product very often I will use this and I've had this for a number of weeks now and if I'm using a style that I've got today which takes hairspray and freeze products and sort of texturizing powders and things just to get that volume what we don't realize of course is our scalp is the extension of the skin of our face now we wouldn't spray all of those products all over our face and then not have the proper care of what we look after so for example it's really really important to give your that time to your scalp health and it's really really important that you make sure that you get the whole of your scalp and you use the correct products especially if you're starting to feel that your scalp is out of balance now the shampoo here I'll just tell you a little bit about it it says the body shop ginger anti-dandruff shampoo for dry flaky scalp now I have to admit this is a little little bit of a sort of a pet heave of mine which I'm not so keen on when it says for a dry flaky scalp. Okay so it's being sold as an anti-dandruff shampoo but straight off I can absolutely categorically say out there for you is if you had weak hair or if you had an out of balance scalp it would be a really great product to use. Now of course if you have got dandruff then ginger is 
renowned for a product of really improving the health of the scalp and it's an anti-inflammatory naturally now it doesn't say that on here but that's from my own research and my own knowledge of ginger in the background for many years i've enjoyed using ginger in products and things so it's really really nice and it's something which i always find very soothing especially if it's in a product such as a cream or if you've got irritated skin so for the scalp an absolute must product to use now telling you a little bit about this on the back here so it has got the ingredients which I'm just going to pick out very very quickly on the random which I just wanted to pinpoint and of course something which is just worth noting that in a lot of products ah, here we go it's on the bottom line always typically when you're on camera and you couldn't find it but when you have a look on the back here what's really pleasant to see is that it's ginger root oil in here in so many products when you go to buy something on the high street it says it's ginger then you look on the back and it's literally got nothing in there at all which is really great and the thing what you will absolutely straight away know with the ginger shampoo is that you get that strong scent of natural ginger and it's literally like that you've got the natural ginger product in your hand it doesn't smell fake it doesn't smell over the top it doesn't smell like there's something else in there it is purely the ginger in here which is really pretty amazing and it does get to work on your scalp straight away now, i'll be very honest when i first started using the shampoo when i used it first of all it was a very quick wash through my hair it was first thing in the morning i had lots to get on and do so i kind of thought to myself it's okay Certainly, it's okay. Um, I put the product to one side, used the conditioner again very quickly, and I thought to myself, nice, nice and fresh, nice and zingy, perfect for the morning. And I thought to myself, but I really didn't take time to note the benefits from it. So what I would urge you to do is when you are trying a product such as something which is natural and something which is a little bit more costly than probably what you would use from the high streets, is give yourself time to enjoy the product. So allow yourself plenty of time to use that. Now, the next time when I started using the shampoo, what you note straight away is that it makes the scalp feel really soothed and healthy. Now, it doesn't sting or it doesn't feel uncomfortable. Or it doesn't feel cakey in the hair at all or sticky. What I would say is it doesn't make the hair feel absolutely hugely moisturised where it feels to the point where it's like glass and you haven't got any hair. It's lightly moisturised but what you can tell is it really concentrates on the hair and the, the scalp rather and it really does concentrate on making the scalp feel quite renewed, quite fresh but calm and gentle and what's really nice about it is it doesn't make you feel of course straight off itchy or anything like that at all. An anti-dandruff shampoo can very often if you've used them at all before and I've used them because very often they can mean better hair growth it can be quite harsh and it can be quite irritating to the back of the neck of course the nape of the neck and the scalp as well make you quite itchy and out of balance even more so of course it can be this vicious circle this doesn't do that at all to you with that ginger root oil in there it's very soothing but you don't necessarily know about it you've got that nice scent of ginger in the hair and it just makes everything feel really quite relaxed really quite soothed ready then for you to go on to the conditioner now, I don't necessarily leave the shampoo in my hair at all um, for any length of time. Just um, I always like to make sure that I massage my scalp in. And I'd always say if you've got an out of balance scalp, that's a really great, important thing to do is take the time and really sort of knead your scalp, really invigorate the scalp there. Of course, because what you're going to be doing is you're going to get that blood flow pumping to the scalp and that's going to be helping your scalp is going to be helping the cells, it's going to be helping the hair roots, really get that blood flow pumping and lifting away any stress, any tension, which is really, really great, of course, for the scalp and of course for you as well. Next then, we will move on to the conditioner. Now, this is slightly different because of course it's ginger, yes, and we have confirmed that it has got ginger root oil in both the shampoo and the conditioner. But what's really nice in here, which was very surprising, is now a lot of people won't probably necessarily know what centronella oil is, but centronella oil is really fresh, it's really zingy, it's almost like makes you think that you're out in the garden, it's really fresh, and it's a lovely, lovely scent. It's quite strong, and in some scenarios it can be very overpowering but it's not overpowering in the conditioner but it does have that scent in here so you've got the ginger and then you've got the notes of the centronella uh, cent oil in here as well which is lovely and soothing now let's just take a point here and just to have a look on the conditioner so the body shop ginger scalp care conditioner is for dry scalp and weak hair that i would absolutely agree with again weak hair dry scalp now when i say weak hair 
that doesn't necessarily mean that if you've got coloured hair and it just snaps. That's something slightly different. For me, weaker hair pinpoints out that if you've got something where, for example, that your hair, um, like me, for example, if you're using a wax or a putty product in your hair, or if you're using hairspray or you're pulling your hair back, possibly if you're a lady watching this and you're tying your hair back and your hair comes away quite easily, more than what you would like, to me, that's that the hair isn't necessarily very strongly anchored to the scalp in certain places. That doesn't mean to say all oh, your hair is going to come away because it doesn't at all. But we've all been there when you've run your hands through your hair and you've got more hands in your hair than what you'd like or in your brush. So, for example, what this conditioner does after using it on and off for a couple of weeks now, I find that it makes the hair feel stronger. And in a way, what it does is it makes the hair feel more anchored to the scalp. And I know that straight off because then when you run a brush or a comb for your hair or if you go to style your hair, there is less hairs which naturally come away in your hands. That doesn't necessarily mean to say that the product is helping against hair loss, but of course ginger is an anti-inflammatory natural product. It does help against occipital stress in the scalp as well, which is on the cell basis. Now please don't take my word for that, but that is a well-known product of which ginger naturally does. So if it's in a shampoo and a conditioner product, I have found that it really does boost the health of my scalp. So therefore I'm going to tell you about it because I'm not represented by Body Shop at all. I have a very good experience through different hair care products and I will use them. If I don't like them I will certainly be very honest and tell you. If I like them then I will shout about it and I will spread that word to certain people. Of course we all want to look good so if there is something which I can help or give a tip away or give some advice away of what products are great for different areas of the hair which you might be concerned with for example, weak hair, thin hair, thinning hair, this ginger range will be amazing for you to try because it boosts energy straight away with the shampoo. It kind of boosts texture into the hair. So if you have got long, fine hair and you're thinking to yourself that you could have a bit more thickness in your hair or a bit more fullness or a little bit more texture, but you don't want it to feel like that you've got so much sort of spray or like a hairspray product in your hair at all, then the shampoo and the conditioner is great because what it does is, yes, it looks after the scalp and yes, it looks after the hair, but it also gives you natural texture in the hair as well. Now, if you're looking for moisturization in the hair as well, then simple tip of the conditioner is just leave the conditioner to act a little bit longer. Now for me, because I like fullness and texture in my hair, the conditioner, I just leave a little bit longer in my hair. So for example, by standard two, three, five minutes whilst I'm doing everything else in the bathroom. If you've got quite dry hair or if you've got chemically treated hair, for example, like I have different highlights which you can see throughout my hair, and leave it on a bit longer. And bear in mind, other days and other seasons, your hair is going to need more different care. So for example, one day you may just use the shampoo. That might well be enough for you. Some days you might be a bit agitated. So then what you're going to do after the shampoo and the conditioner, you're going to then go on and use the scalp serum drops, which we will come on to in just a moment. On other days, you might feel that you actually don't necessarily need to use a shampoo. You may just wet your hair down and you may just use conditioner because that's a great tip. If you've got damaged hair, but yet you still want the benefits of the dry, the dry scalp, the weak hair, wet the hair down, use a conditioner. All different tips of this range which you can use and it gives you the boost of energy, the boost of health you're looking for, that invigoration from the ginger and of course the great knowledge of knowing that you're using a responsible sourced product for the world, the environment and for us as well by The Body Shop which is great. Let's move on to the scalp serums drops. So this one here, this product here is a bit of a shock at first to use because what this is is it's quite a thick product. It's quite high viscosity. So that is quite difficult necessarily to take out of a pipette product. So it comes in a glass pipette and it's quite a thick, sticky sort of honey-like product, which is really nice and soothing. Now straight away, the smell of these drops are just incredible. It's the strongest sort of ginger, which you would have known in a product. Um, me anyway, and I've used a lot of products with different, with different spices and sort of essential oils and things in, which have been promoting thicker hair, suit, scalp, all sorts of things. So this really amazing in terms of fragrance. The smell knocks you back and it's really uplifting and lovely. Now, why would you necessarily want to use scalp 
scalp serum, scalp drops. So for example, it says here for a nourished and rebalanced scalp. I'll be very honest, I was actually doing some research for thinning hair online and I come across um, a, little, a little bit of an article in regards to the most important factor for thinning thin hair. Now I have fine hair and I have a lot of it. Thankfully I don't have thinning hair yet, but prevention is always better than cure, <laughs> as I always say. So with the scalp serum drops, what I came across and what that said is that the scalp serum drops is really invigorating, it boosts energy and it looks after the scalp. Now of course you have to have a well-balanced healthy scalp to grow the most amazing hair end of whatever anybody else says to you how much amazing you all these sprays and products and serums and things you put on your hair if you're not looking after your scalp end of you finished already to be quite honest with you so it's important to always massage the scalp really get your and get your fingers going get your scalp invigorated and then of course finish off with the the shampoo the conditioner the scalp serum drops you don't have to do this every day once twice three times a week that's what i do and what i do is i part my hair in sort of one two three lines and then in the back i sort of go in a little bit more detail and i take one or two drops of the serum so literally sort of like a pipette at the top and it comes through into the pipette here and it's like honey it's the texture of honey and then literally i drop several drops in the back of my scalp several in the middle here and then i literally follow through the lines of how i parted my hair and then I take a moment of just massaging that into my scalp. And the only way I can kind of describe how that makes your hair feel, because it conditions the hair, it moisturises the hair, and it makes the scalp feel really soothed, really nourished, and just lovely, to be quite honest with you. Lovely, whether you've got a, whether you're men, women watching this, it's great for your hair. It's great for turning things around if you've got out of balance scalp, if you've got itchy, if you've got an itchy scalp, perhaps you've got dandruff, perhaps you've got that flaky scalp, which is really annoying. We've all been there when you've seen somebody or you've been somewhere in a workplace and you can see that somebody's troubled with their scalp on their shoulders. It's the worst thing in the world. I wouldn't wish it on anybody at all. The ginger serum, the ginger conditioner, the ginger shampoo would be a perfect gift range for anybody who is having those problems at all. For me, it was a gift to myself and I'm really, really pleased I got that because it makes my hair feel really nourished, really conditioned. And actually, I didn't notice, but until I'd started using this, around my hair is much more soothed and much more comfortable. I use a lot of hair products. That's an understatement, to be quite honest with you. I use a lot of free spray, a lot of wax, hair gel, texturizing powders. You name it, I use it for different hairstyles. I like a lot of different hairstyles. So sometimes I can be guilty of neglecting my scalp, as we all probably can be. Of course, throw heat on the top of that, throw chemical treatments through highlights in as well. We all do it, man and woman. We all want to look great. Why wouldn't you? It's important then to take time. If you're spending all of that on your hair, it's then important then to spend the time and to spend on the right products on yourself because then of course if you've got great health balance of scalp health then of course your hair is going to keep growing it's going to flourish and you're going to be happy with what you've got for many years to come so hopefully you would have took away a few points there about the ginger body shop range in terms of shampoo conditioner and the scalp serum drops as i said i noticed with the scalp serum why not but i want to use that because i now notice i'm so much more comfortable around the edges of my hair which feels strange but of course when you're sort of smoothing everything you're in or if you've got this sort of pompadour look what i've got going on Every time I film, there's always a dog barking in the background. Do excuse me, let's just keep going. It says that this is natural and this is live, to be quite honest with you. <laughs> Obviously, not by the time you're going to see this, but I'm just going to keep going. So if you do hear that, I do apologise. But what it just goes to show that actually you don't necessarily think you need this until you try it, but it does boost the health of your scalp. And I feel so much more comfortable when I've got a style in, because if you think about it, you spray a lot of spray around here to sort of flatten in uh, the hair and make the hair look sleek and style and polished. So yeah, absolutely. It would certainly be something I would absolutely recommend. Let's talk a little bit more now about the price, because of course that's very important for us all. But let's start with the shampoo. So if you were to buy this from the Body Shop or the Body Shop at Home range, now this is £7.50 for a 250ml. Then if we move on to the conditioner, it's £7.50 again, and that's from the Body Shop and the Body Shop at Home range as well. And the Scalp Serum, which is a little bit more of an investment for yourself, and that's £15. Now I know altogether that is a little bit more of an investment than a high street product range, but 
if you think about it, with what you pay out on your hair for haircuts and products and colours and what have you, if you invest that little bit more on products which actually last and last, I mean, I've had this now for quite a while. And to be honest with you, I'm not really even half, uh, I'm about a third of the way through. I haven't got super long hair, I haven't got super thick hair, so I don't need to use loads of it. You can use a small amount in the palm of your hand. It lathers really, really nicely as well. Wet your hair first of all, and you'll be surprised how much it lasts. The scalp serum drops, of course, you're using that twice, three times a week possibly even just once a week, but give yourself time for this. That's one thing I would suggest. Give yourself time for this and really concentrate on the scalp and really concentrate on massaging and kneading that into the scalp as well, because that way you will see the benefits more of loosening up the scalp, loosening up the scalp skin, and of course, really, really helping that hair grow, because then of course, what you're doing is you're getting that blood flow pumping to the surface. You're giving that hair that boost of life, that energy. And of course, anything which gives you ultra clean, ultra healthy, energized, and that boost of circulation in the hair as well. And of course, ginger root oil is naturally anti-inflammatory, is going to help against all scalp conditions. So it's certainly worth a try. And if you have any comments or questions at all which you want to put past me, then do drop them in my comments below and I will certainly do my best to get back to you. Okay, and I suppose in the last thing as well, where did I get these products from? So you can walk into the body shop and you can buy them, absolutely. But as with everything on my channel, I'm super honest and I like to be very, very open. So these products were purchased by my brother's fiance, who is also a very, very good and dear friend to me. And I am going through some different products as well from the body shop. She's a representative of the body shop at home range. So I will be probably trying some different shampoos and things from the range going forward. And of course, sharing my views, sharing my review, my opinions and things with you as well. So it can turn around and help you with what you're wanting to do, whether that be improve different areas of your scalp, or it could even just be if you want to treat yourself and you're a man, you're a woman. And just a bit of an idea of who to get it for. Okay, so thank you very much indeed for watching my clip. I have certainly enjoyed doing this one. I hope you have too. And as I say, if you do have any questions for me, leave them down below and I'll be sure to get back to you as quick as I can. So until next time, we will see you then. Bye for now. Bye.